Hello, everybody, and welcome out. Welcome has, dares has, ah, I've, 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 I've literally have redone this like three times, so I'm not going to redo it again. You guys got the fail and trust me. I'm sorry. That's probably because I'm tired because I was up until, for the last two days, I was been up and not even in my house before 3.30 in the morning. And I've been up like before 10, actually, every time. I don't know why. I thought I'd be like, oh man, let's sleep in. But then I just wake up naturally. I don't know what's going on, so, eh. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, yesterday actually ended up being very fun. Like, I think, yeah, yesterday I was talking about going to the fair, and I was like, I'm not going to go because I don't got time for that. And then I think, like, an hour after I made the video and posted it, my friend was like, hey, you want to go to the fair? Because my girlfriend's never been to the fair, and I got to take her to the fair. I was like, oh, okay, I guess I'm going to the fair. So I went to the fair last night, and it was actually pretty awesome. I didn't ride anything just because I was like... I'm cheap, and I'm not gonna pay any money for, you know, fair prices and stuff, because I think, yeah, I did buy a funnel cake, it was huge, like, massive funnel cake, like, I, I don't know if you've ever been to Six Flags, but they have delicious, delicious funnel cakes, but they're usually pretty small, it was like, three of, uh, it was like three of a Six Flags funnel cakes piled on top of each other, and it was wide, like, wider, like, wider than the plate they put it on. And then it's like had a half a cup powdered sugar on it. It was delicious. The only thing I didn't like about it is that uh, I think like he, they were making them as they were getting ordered. And there was a giant line. So I feel like they weren't cooking them long enough because mine was kind of, it was a little too spongy. I wanted a little more crispy and it would have been just the best funnel cake ever. It was massive. I didn't even eat it all because my friend's girlfriend also didn't, has never had a funnel cake before. And I was like, that just is not going to fly. So I gave her some of mine and she ended up actually eating like, I actually want to say like 75% because it was massive and I couldn't eat it all because so we like shared it Yeah, and it was only six bucks. It was six bucks and I was like this is like the most worthwhile six bucks I've ever spent and then yeah, it was like a dollar to get into the fair so seven bucks I spent um, Yeah, we were gonna get my fr other friend got a hot dog and I was like because the fair started like earlier in the day at about I want to say like earlier in the day like 10 and he got a hot dog and it was like nine thir nine o'clock at night when we went, so uh, we were there, and he got the hot dog, and I was like, they're not cooking that. They didn't cook that hot dog. She pulled that out of a thing that was not, like, like a warming game. It was like, that hot dog's been in there for, like, at least 12 hours. I'm not going to eat any fair food. And, yeah, later that night, I mean, later last night, you could tell it was actually hurting him a little bit. Yeah, so, don't. So, moral sort, don't eat old food from fairs, and they're not probably worth it. Because it was like two bucks, I was like, we'll probably just go to like Waffle House or something at the end of this, and it gets something anyway. And, whoop, <clears throat> burps. And we did. I like I'm burping, but I actually haven't uh, eaten anything today. I haven't actually had anything since the uh, Waffle House last night. I got a couple of burgers. I wanted more, but I only brought cash with me, because... We were going to the fair, and you had to have cash, so I was like, okay, I'm not going to bring my bank card, and I didn't have it with me, and then I didn't drive, so I left it, and yeah, I didn't have it, so <laughs> I had like six more bucks for the Waffle House, I was like, I can get a $5 meal, and then I was like, ah, I don't want to buy a drink though, so I didn't, but yep, yeah, that was my evening, uh, we saw some fireworks there, my friends got on the Gravitron, it just looks like a cool spaceship ride where it's just like G-Force and it spins and it's just cool and yeah, then they got on a giant Ferris wheel that was very rickety. It was horrifying. Yeah, I wanted to win this giant wolf thing, but I again didn't want to spend. I only thought I had two dollars in pocket the whole time. Then I pulled out six bucks when we got off. I was like, wow, I didn't know I had this much still in my pocket. I would probably play, like wrote something or play something because they like it was like a lot for tickets to ride stuff. And then some of the rides cost like three or four tickets. I was like, that's ridiculous. And then they had the crazy, I, I was just like, I'm not going to spend any money here. But it was fun to walk around. I saw a lot of people from like high school and stuff. It was crazy. But good day. Very good day. And then then we went back to my friend's house, played some, oh, I forget what the name of the game was. Uh, it's like Mario Party. It's like a Mario Party style RPG. I was thinking actually playing if it if it's on Steam, I think I'm gonna buy it and play it on my gaming channel. So check it out. Uh I think, what was it called? Dokapon Kingdom, I think it was called, yeah. And it's just RPG Mario Party. So it's like a really, really long Mario Party session you'd be playing and you're literally leveling up and getting stronger as you go around a giant map, like board game to style map fighting monsters and stuff. It's like it's it's really cool. But yeah, that was fun. Uh then I came back home that night and I was like, okay. 
Time to go to sleep. And then I got really, really sick because, again, I feel like the funnel cake was not cooked all the way. And I had, like, woke up in the middle of the night and had a stomach ache. I'm like, yep, that's probably from the funnel cake that wasn't finished cooking. So, yeah. But it was a delicious funnel cake all the same. And today, I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm recording this early because I was like... I have nothing else to do, but actually I was like, I need to go and record some more gaming stuff. So I'll probably be doing that all day because they wanted me to come back. and Because we, the Dokemon Kingdom is such a long game that you couldn't probably finish it. Like, I think we were playing for like three hours and didn't finish it. So we didn't even get like past the first part. So I was like, we have a lot to do. But I, I was like, we were going to play it again today. But I was like, I got some crap I got to do. I'm about to go upstairs and ask mom if we can go get some Japanese. Because I want some Japanese right now. I'm starving. I haven't eaten anything today. But that is all. I have been just talking my butt off today. I actually like it. I'm sitting down this time because I just didn't feel like walking around. Actually, I want to change it up so that I am always walking around. But, you know. Uh, but that's it. I had a fun night, and I'm tired, and I just, like, showered like crazy and all that. It's, I don't know, it's like 3 o'clock now, and it has been good. But thank you for watching, everybody. I will catch you all next time for more vloggy vloggy action, or fun-filled talking. And I will see you tomorrow. And tell me, have you ever had it? Where was the most delicious funnel cake you ever had? And have you not had one? Because if you haven't had one... Do something about that, because they're freaking delicious. Peace out.